Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to another episode of City Bus Manager. Today we're back in Tarvin, where uh, a lot of our buses are actually in a decent state of repair. We're basically starting off here exactly where we left uh, in the last episode. We've got everything, I think, is everybody back in the depot now? It's Sunday night. Yeah, I think everybody's back in the depot now. So, uh, yep, yeah, I've been away for two weeks, so the last couple of episodes were bulk recorded. However, uh, we are back now. I'm back off my Ollie Bobs, and uh, yeah, there's been a couple of people getting a little bit wound up because they were bulk recorded the previous episode, so I was making the same mistake again and again and again. Now, uh, when I'm hiring people in particular, this is one thing we need to look at. It has been explained to me multiple times as it happens that, uh, hang on, where are our staff? Let's hire some new ones. Uh, everyone needs a locker. Right, okay, we can't do that. That's annoying. Uh, we'll go back to how we are at the moment. So if you look, the actual skill at the top here is advanced. So that's as, as you know, as they work for us longer, their skill does get higher. Uh, I mean, look, there we go. We've got experts there. Skill is full. So really, when we're employing new people, all we really need to look at is friendliness. Now, that is obviously a game mechanic that's changed. Uh, so I, I think personally it's changed for the better. Uh, but yeah, when we're hiring new people, we just want the friendly people because obviously the skill, even if the skill is at zero, they will uh, improve over time. So that's uh, that's all good stuff. All good stuff. Now, since we last saw each other as well, uh, there has been a couple of new mods that have come out for this. So I have made a point of downloading those in the marketplace. You can see we've got an Optest Solo M920. I think that's the longer one. I think it's a, just one solo. I know there's an 8.9 meter Enviro 200. Uh, there is also a 10 point something or other meter, but look, the doors are on the correct side, so that's, uh, that's obviously good stuff. There's uh, a couple of second hand ones there. Uh, they can actually fit in a small parking space. I was doing a little bit of experimenting with them uh, just before uh, I re hit record. And uh, yeah, what we're going to do is we're going to buy a new one. In fact, to tell you what, we're going to sell that one. How much are we going to sell it for? Uh, per my purchase price was three grand, but then did I buy them brand new? I can't, I can't remember how how much did I buy it for? New? Was it a second hand one? I, I can't remember. Did I buy that new? It says three grand on both of them. Has, has the money gone up? Has the monetary value gone up? I don't know. Right, I tell you what, we'll do then. We won't sell that because uh, we'll, we'll look at expanding our fleet rather than. Uh, Rather than making it smaller. We always want to have more, don't we? Is, uh, is everybody... Everybody's clean and ready to go for tomorrow, aren't they? I mean, there's nobody that needs any repairs. Because there's no smoke. Uh, nobody can see any smoke. We'll refuel you while you're there. Go on, off you go. Everyone else, apart from that, is, uh, is looking good. God, it's one o'clock in the morning on Monday. Hmm. Has that been refueled yet? Yes, it has. Right, okay. Well, what we'll do is we'll time jump. we hey. Right, so we need something on the Chester Park and Ride. That can be... Uh, we, we put the orange ones usually, don't we? 101. Is that the... That's the big one, isn't it? Let's, uh... Let's just can... No, no, don't cancel it. Don't cancel it. But I, I want to see the map. I, I just... Stop. Stop, stop, stop. Just stop assigning. I'll have to assign the 101. Uh, I, I we'll put a capacity on it. Which one is it that comes through it? The 101. Yeah, that's the correct one. God, it's been that long. I've forgotten what buses go where. Right, so we're going to put John Abel on that one. The 100 there. Key and Horwood. Off you go. T1. That's a little diddy one, isn't it? You can be you. Can be you. The 102. Again, we'll stick one of them on it. And Chester Park and Ride. Yeah, another one of them. Off you go, Iceman. 103, Mike. Right, hello to you. Uh, Kvarts, 186. Off you go on the 101. You're on the bendies today. Imran Arriva, hello. You are off on the 102. Where's the 102 go, Imran? Where are you going? Uh, is that the 102 up there? No, that's the 103. That's the 100. Is the 102, that's the fast one, isn't it, into Chester that comes down here to the business park. Oh, well, Imran's on those today. So if we, uh, if we speed that up a little bit, we'll get everybody... Uh, out and about quick sticks. Oh yeah, in the last episode I was expanding that, wasn't I? 
Right, 102. Who else is on the uh, the 102? Lego County fan, off you go. Yeah, so obviously it's going to be quite a mammoth task is, uh, is changing over all the buses because we're basically going to have to sell everything we've got so far. Uh, which, you know, that is a task. It's a hell of a task, isn't it, really? Particularly when we've got no money. But it is Monday morning now. Sundays isn't the busiest day. Ooh, Chester Park and Ride, another one of you. Off you go. Yeah, Sundays isn't the busiest of days, is it? So, uh, yeah, I, I tend to find... I mean, look at this. I've, oh, hang on, 101. Jan Koppelman. You were mean to me in the last video, Jan. Said that you were going to report me to the authorities. I've not forgotten. Uh, 102. Right, who else is going on the 102? It's Studio Polygon. Off you go, love. So this area that goes to uh, Weaverham. Assuming I've pronounced that right. I don't know how busy these are going to be. Because I don't think we've had this over the weekend, have we? We've not had this service. I mean, it's quarter to six in the morning. And this bus has got quite a few on. There we go. Through Norley. But 20 people at this time in the morning is perfectly respectable. I'm happy with that. I wonder if they're going to Tarvin and then changing. Yeah, it looks like quite a few have got off there at Tarvin, haven't they? Right, 101, you're a bendy, so it's going to be uh, Mr. Curtis. Off you go. I can't believe after all this we've not exactly generated a lot of cash, have we? Let's, uh, let's have a look at how the 101's doing. There's quite a few full buses down there. That's, that's what we like to see. I mean, they're really busy, aren't they? Look at that. Who's is that? That's, uh, oh, that's Imran. Imran Ariva. He's on the, uh, God, you've got a few people on your bus, Imran. Right, down we go. Yep, yeah, they're still busy coming back. Wow. He's making the money today, isn't he? He's earning his pennies. Who have we got going the other way there? That's uh, Lego County fan. Again, full and standing for you guys. The 102 could really do with Bim Bendy's as well. I mean, yeah, 102 seems to be getting busier than the 101 now. Having said that, the 101 lot, it's got 64 people on. So I think when we're a little bit close to the time, we're going to end up with double deckers on there, aren't we? Uh, what have we got in terms of research? Because I have downloaded some double deckers. We've got 11 double deckers now. Yeah, I've been downloading metro buses and all sorts. Right, let's start the solo buses because I want to get those enviros. Uh, I have got a longer Enviro and a Scania Omnicity. I mean, the Omnicity is going to end up replacing these guys, isn't it? So, we've earned a little cash prize there. So what we're going to do is I think we're going to sell you. Yep, we're, we're just going to sell you. We'll ask three grand. Yep, we'll ask 2,900. It's not in a good enough state of repair, obviously. We'll, we'll offer to sell it. And we'll reduce the buster. We'll, we'll pay for that. Don't need any of that nonsense yet. That's all for... Oh, we'll reduce the repair times. Now, oh, there we go. We'll research that as well. Research, again, we could do these. But I don't want to... Oh, you see, we could get a double-decker. But what is it going to come back with? No. What we're going to do is, before we start going too new, we're going to look at replacing our current fleet. So the Enviro 200... What can you carry? So you can actually, even though you're a little bus, you can carry 56 passengers. That's mental. I mean, the master can only carry 19, so it makes sense. Should we have a couple of solos? How much is that? 21,600. Let's have a couple of solos. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That's ace. The model quality is brilliant. I think this is by Mr. Chips. That is absolutely fantastic. I mean, sometimes when your buses get quite full... Or when your bus station gets quite full of buses. It can lag like you don't know what. But that is awesome. Oh, I love that. Right, let's buy two solos. I mean, these guys can carry... How many can you carry, guys? You can carry 55. That is a massive improvement on there, isn't it? Uh, marketplace. Right, sales offers. Has nobody asked to buy these masters yet? I guess why would you when the solo's available? Quite long for the parking space, isn't it? But I guess Mr. Chips could make all different lengths of that solo, couldn't he? That's, this is awesome. I'm really sorry, guys, that I haven't done this sooner. It's brilliant. So if I ask for that solo to be refuelled, are they going to get on here rather than around the other side? 
I mean, ask a silly question. We'll refuel that one as well. I guess we don't really need it to be refueled. Wow, look at that! Oh, that is so cool. I mean, he's just smashed it through the travel center, but you know, you can't have everything, can you? Oh, that is brilliant. I love it. I love it. Could really do with those selling now, couldn't we? Kvart's fuming again. Sorry, Kvart. Oh, I'm so happy. Really, really happy with the solo. Right, let's see if we've got something for the solos to do. I mean, the um, it's quite busy on there, isn't it? People were saying as well, if, if your buses are too busy, like if your buses are really busy, just put another, just shove everything in the depot out. It's quite a good idea, really, isn't it? Because they just do two round trips. Right, so where's, where's Tarvin? Let's see, so this is Tarvin. Let's see, can we go somewhere big down here? Not really. We can go down to Tarpoli. Or Tarpoli. Eaton! Wow, lovely. We could go around to Tarpoli, but again, there's, there's not really a lot happening here, is there? I imagine this is a lot busier in real life. Oh wow, we've unlocked a 10.9 meter Enviro 200! Oh! I knew that that uh, solo bus was an excellent decision. Right, marketplace. We've got the 8.9 meter and the 10.9 meter. Ah, I'm really excited about this. Right, let's have uh, a 10.9 meter Enviro 200. You can carry 61 passengers. That's a fairly respectable amount, isn't it? Oh, what are they offering? Naomi. But that's nothing. No. Well, you can go away. Oh, we'll get rid of you, because we need the space. 1,800 will accept it. I mean, I did not... Yeah, that, that wasn't good, was it? Really wasn't good. What we might try doing... Well, we've got 12,000, so let's buy uh, a new Enviro 200. We'll have a 10.9 meter. There we go, I'll have one of them. One of them. Oh, it's awesome. Look at the quality of the model at the front. For City Bus Manager, that is pretty awesome. Okay, if that turned up in OMSI, you'd be a little bit miffed, wouldn't you? But, I mean, it's, it doesn't matter. Now, hopefully, the 10.9 meter won't fit in this space. I have a horrible feeling it's going to try. Oh, it's going for a medium space. That is good. Oh, I like it. Because it's obviously a bigger bus. The reg plate, Enviro 200 on it, I would prefer it if that wasn't there. And if it was, I mean, the Solo doesn't have a yellow plate at the back. If it was just a plain, plain yellow, that would be more my, uh, my sort of what I'd prefer. But again, that's, that's just my personal preference. That's, that's pretty awesome. Should we, should we get the Enviro refueled as well, see if the doors work on it? Are you going to play with the Enviro, sir? I imagine he's used the same doors. Oh, but it's so cool! I love it. Do you know what? It's it's such a simple thing to get really excited about, isn't it? But I'm I'm really really happy. Right? Do you know what? We're gonna send the solo out on the Chester Park and Ride, and it's gonna be Chris behind the wheel there. Off you go. Because again, the Park and Ride. How many has it got on it? It's got two buses. It really does. It need two buses. I mean, fifteen. Okay, there's a few people on it. But we're going to uh, relegate the Optair Solos to the park and ride. Because that's sort of like the free town bus, isn't it? I know it's not free. And Chester's a city rather than a town. So it's more the, the not free city bus. Chester Park and Ride, Road and Rail Studios. Off you go in a solo, my friend. Tell you what we're going to do. We're going to put all these on for sale. Uh, purchase price, 13900 We'll put it right up at the top. Did we buy these second hand by any chance? I'm going to put it right up at the top so that if anybody... Oh, there we go. Bang that right up there. I'm going to leave some buses so that we've got them for the uh, for the afternoon schedule. 
Hang on, why why is there a third one going on the Chester Park and Ride? Why does it want three buses? Heck, that's no good. What are, what are you assigned to then? You're the 1355 and 1410. Why have we got three buses? I, I didn't imagine that we had three on the circuit. CPR, CPR, CPR. Oh, we do have three on the circuit. Oh, that's annoying. Right, we need another solo. Quick, then. Right. Gene Clark offers that amount. No, that's that's half the money, Gene. We paid, like, 13 grand on all these. So we want to make a bit of cash. Oh, solo's so expensive. Let's have a, a solo. That's a solo. How about... 5,900! Oh, they've accepted it. Wow, that's incredible. We've got 29 quid left. What on earth has happened there? It's Someone's thrown toilet roll at it. Right. Get them two done. I mean, it's not particularly dirty inside, isn't it? I wonder if he's got it so the green comes out of this side as well. Oh, you've received a new offer. Right, the T1 can be you. Off you go, Wobbly Cucumber. Can I can I not send Wobbly Cucumber on that? Assign the T1. No. Can we send Wobbly Cucumber on that one? Oh, is it because it's up for sale? I see. Right, the Tarvin one can be... Uh, right, we'll, we'll take it off sale then. And send Wobbly Cucumber on that one. There we go. Ah, there we go. Look, it's all clean now. Should we paint it white so it blends in with the rest of the solos? There we go. Right, Chester Park and Ride. Seems a bit of a waste, doesn't it, really, having a solo on it? But then 55, how much can you carry? We've been using buses that can carry 87. So it's, it means that we've got that fleet for later, doesn't it? So, not operational. Why are you not operational? Chester Park and Ride. Why is it not operational? Is it in a state... Oh, right, brake pads, I see. Right, come on then. Get it fixed. Quick, 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 or this is going to be late. It's operational now. There we go. Right, Lego County fan, off you go, please, on the uh, on the solo. You're on the park and rides today as well. 102, that's a busy route, isn't it, at this time in an afternoon. So, John Abel, uh, off you go in the Lion City. Citaro C2, I forget it's got the wrong back end, doesn't it? 101, that can be Iomex in your bendy bus. I trust him with a bendy bus. He sort of frightens me a little bit, so I'll let him take whatever bus he wants, and I imagine he'd want an 18 metre bendy, to be honest with you. The 103, that can be... Oh, we'll send Iceman out on an Enviro. He'll be livid, hasn't he already gone out today? There's no available bus to run the shift. Right, let's look at what the marketplace offers are. Right. You've offered us more than 13,900, so we'll accept that. No, no. Sarah C2, no, we're not. We're not playing that game. That was more or less everything, wasn't it? Right, so we need to... Right, we'll take them off sale. Send them out on the 100 and the 102. There you go. Oh, wait, Frank Coles is off out again. They're not going to be happy bunnies, you know, Joe. You're, you're taking the mick here. Well, I'll tell you what we'll do. We're sort of running out of space, aren't we? We could do with expanding the depot premises. I never thought I'd say that. Right, I bought selling that for the time being. Yeah, I bought the sale. It does seem a little bit weird, you know, running... Oh, Studio Polygon, off you go again. They're going to be so stressed, aren't they, by the end of today. 
102. 101 could do with being a bendy. Oh, hang on. What's this coming back? Right. Jan Koppelman. Off you go, Jan. You can have extra work for being mean to me. We'll assign that. Yeah, right. Go. You can go back out on the 102. And then there's a 101. Again, it could do with being a bendy. But if it's not a bendy, that's not the end of the world. Oh, hang on. Yeah, get that done. I quite like some double-deckers. I would quite like some double-deckers, but... Uh, Right, there we go. We'll sell that. We want three grand for it. I mean, we're only going to lose on that, aren't we? But it's fine. You're good. You need cleaning and sorting. Everyone else is happy. You're, uh, you're being sorted, aren't you? Everyone's coming back from the morning shift, aren't they? Oh, have the buses stopped? Oh no, I was going to say, have they stopped driving through each other? That doesn't seem to be the case anymore. <laughs> they uh, they appear to still drive through each other. Oh, hang on. But they do seem to wait for someone reversing in and that. They, they seem to wait. They never used to do that, do they? Right. What can we do about the, uh, if we've got a marketplace? Yeah, you see, I want more 10.9 metre enviros. We got any? I wonder if there's a way that you can, like, tell the game you you don't want to see any of the, you know, the, the basic stuff. You know, and you only want to see the British stuff. That would be quite good if you could untick like the, the the basic stuff so it would only offer me British buses because then you wouldn't have to keep researching would you you know to unlock the unlock the British stuff because that would mean that when we start a new game we might end up with buses with doors on the wrong side you know and that's that's not what we want is it ah, you're still good enough complains about the friendliness of the bus drivers that sounds about right you're all a very unfriendly group of people We'll ask 18,000 for that. Try and research more solo buses. What I don't want to do is accidentally sell too many buses. Let's have a uh, marketplace. Is there any more Enviros now? Enviro, Enviro, Enviro. There's no Enviros. I never thought I'd want a fleet of Enviro 200s, but it appears to be what we need. Right, there we go. We'll buy you. What colour are you coming? You're coming grey. No, we'll we'll have just plain white. Another brand new bus is on its way. Look at that. It's nice, isn't it? We'll keep the bendy buses, because quite frankly we need the capacity. I don't think we've got a UK style bendy bus as of yet. I think I've got a couple of Citaros as well uh, in the Bendy Bus fleet. But again, we need to research them. Right, if you need sending out, we'll send you. You know what I mean? Could we put more lockers here? I guess we could do, couldn't we? Oh, a Citaro! Wow, let's have a look. So, Citaro 0530N. Right, so that is a... Is that a Mark 1 Citaro or a, a Mark 2? I don't know, but it's 17 grand. Well, i tell you what, we'll buy one of those if we can. It can only carry 56. Are you having a laugh? Oh, I mean, that can only carry 40. No, hang on. It can carry 40. It can seat 40. But it can carry 61. Right, okay. So, the other one can carry... 56 but it can probably no it can seat 56 it can carry more than that that's that's what we want right sell you they're all really like sort of there, there we go sell for more money sell for more money we'll just get them all on the market
Right, let's have a look in the marketplace. Uh, see if we can get any sort of cheap deal. Oh, right, you're offering 1,200. Do you know what? I'm sick of it. Let's just get rid of it. It's not great, but those masters, I don't think we're going to be able to make a lot of money on them. Right, so, in City LE, yep, be, 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 five. Oh, Citaro C2, Joseph, Joseph Spencer is not offering enough money. Go away, Joseph. Now. Uh, have we got, uh, you see, it's not got any English buses on there. This is a disaster. Right, so we're going to have to buy brand new again, aren't we? Well, we'll have a Citaro. Because you're going to look right at home replacing the current fleet. Because right, the C2s can only carry 40. Right, what's uh, Dominica Otto? Not enough money. Sorry, Dominica. It needs to be more than 14 grand, otherwise we've lost money on it. And I don't really want to replace them to lose money. You know what I mean? Right, Citaro 530. Heck, we've not got long left of the episode. Look at that. Oh, it's a, C it's a Citaro Mark II as well. Good looking bus. I like it. Right, let's get you in plain white. So you sort of blend in with the rest of the fleet. Look at it. Oh, wow, I'm so pleased. It's got the Mercedes badge at the front. That is lovely. Do you know what? I'm going to have to really... Pull my finger out and work on some repaints, aren't I? I love it. And how many can you actually... You can move 90 people. So you can seat 56 and then that's, what, 34 standing? That's not bad. It's not bad at all. How are we doing outside, then? Uh, right, this Chester Park and Ride, the CPR, is one minute late. Is there any bus stops with like an unacceptable amount of passengers waiting? It's middle of the day, isn't it? It doesn't appear so, though. I mean, the uh, the Great Barrow little run there. So again, I think we need something that comes up here through Gilded Sutton and Mickle Trafford, but I think they'll probably want to go into Chester, won't they? They won't want to go to Tarvin. And it could come down this road, up round Mickle Trafford, and then it could come up here, couldn't it, to whatever this town is here, go round back down. Although there's these roads, through Manly, Moulds with Ashton Hayes, that's that's a good route. That is a good route. Right, okay, new route. Let's have it. I mean, I still don't think... Oh, hang on. I don't think we're going to have enough bus uh, buses to operate this. So you're going to be the 104. You're going to go from Tarvin. You're going to go that way. Yeah, lovely. Pool Lane. Shea Lane. And then to Ashton Lane, there. You're going to go up to the Golden Lion. I'll tell you what, you're going to do no such thing. You're going to stop at the Golden Lion there. And then sort of go... I don't know. You, know, you see, I don't like that. We'll go around there. Brookside, yeah. Stop here, because there's a few little things. You see, you don't have, like, a catchment area on the bus stops. So that would be quite useful. Moldsworth. I mean, there's a station at Moldsworth there, so you can stop on the main road near Moldsworth Station. Right, Manly, where are we going here? So we're going up towards... You see, that's all right, isn't it? We've got a Bay Tree Farm. Revelston Lodge. Manly County Primary. See, I don't think there's any buses that stop here. Uh, oh, that one's called Bus Stop. Couple there, look, there we go. And we'll go round here. Linden Drive, Three Ways Gorge. Oh, look at that. This is a right little windy route, isn't it? But it serves lots of little communities, and that's, you know, that's what it's all about. Dunham on the Hill. Right, we're going to go down through Dunham on the Hill. In fact, no, we're not. We're going to stop there at the Dunham Arms, and then we'll go around through Dunham on the Hill, because I think that's what the bus does. Barrow Lane. We'll stop at all the proper bus stops, even though I'm not convinced there's a lot there. Nag Z. Shrewsbury Arms. Yeah, that's good. Mickle Trafford. Right, okay. Perhaps we could go around Mickle Trafford. 
but this can be no. The, we'll we'll have this as like a fairly fast service now from here. Fairfield Road, yet yeah, Dean Hotel. Lovely stone place. Oh, you see, can we can we get down here? No, it would appear not. Stone place, yep. Yeah. Not there. Oh, hang on, how do we? We'll go down through here. Oh no, because if you go down through there, you can't get to the bus station. Right, we'll stop at hallway. We'll go around to the bus interchange. And then, apparently, there's a button you can press to get it to just copy your stops in the rear, in, you know, going back the other way. That is one hell of a route, isn't it, going all the way around there. It's not the fastest route. Go on, then. Shout out. Oh, you can place waypoints as well. That's cool. Shout out if you see it, because I'm not seeing it. The, the copy them in reverse, I think, was what people were saying. I'm not seeing it. Well, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to work out a way to do that before next episode, and then uh, we'll get some more buses. Yeah, if you've got any suggestions, do let me know in the comments. Thank you so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click that like button. We are going to be working on uh, doing some... Uh, some of the, the things, the, the uh, more buses, more routes, replacing the left-hand drive fleet for the right-hand drive stuff. And yeah, uh, so it's certainly worth subscribing so you don't miss out on any of that. Let me know, as I say in the comments, what you think and any buses you recommend. Any workshop links, again, send them to me. I'm, I'm loving it, folks. Absolutely loving it. This is what we need. And uh, yeah, thanks so much for watching. Hopefully, I'll see you all next time. Cheerio! Goodbye for now.